Fire Fraud, the Hulu documentary about the Fire Festival uh, by Billy. Billy McFarlane? Mi Billy Farlane? Billy, 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 this Billy guy, this uh, Billy asshole, this Billy uh, fraud dude. This dude has been scamming for a while. He grew up in the age of computers and stuff like that. And you know, at first this, this documentary I thought was gonna be kind of like a fluff piece, like it's gonna be like, you know, Billy wasn't the baddest guy in the world. You, you know, not a lot of it was his fault. There was a lot of disasters that was going on and uh, <laughs> you know, Billy was just caught up in a bad investment too. But no, really, it, it did start getting at him for a while there. And uh, definitely it was just built up to tell you, hey, Billy, bad guy, especially now that he's in jail. And it did end with him being in jail, which is his current sentence of six years, which, phew, Man, this, this, I've heard a lot about this uh, fire festival through when it was happening, all the stuff that just right after the aftermath, all the craziness, all the people who were advertising it, saying all the great stuff about it. And this, this documentary well put together uh, the, just what was going on in it. And I'm pretty, I'm interested to see what the Netflix documentary of the fire festival, because there is going to be the second documentary and they even comment about it in this documentary. So I can't wait to see that one and see what the angle and, uh, and how much more information I might get about from it. Well, I already know a lot about it, but this it's interesting, just the craziness about this guy and what he's put together and the bullshit that he has accomplished. It, it's just well put together, and there's some fun, there's some interesting, interesting editing choices where they throw in little clips from other different things, uh, just to emphasize uh, the points that they're trying to make. And I, I found that entertaining. I found the the documentary entertaining. It's just the entire story is just so crazy to me, but it makes me laugh because, you know, as we all say, as they say, especially in the documentary, haha, <laughs> rich people, rich people problems. And, uh, yeah, so it's interesting documentary to watch, uh, if you got the ability to watch it on Hulu, check it out. Cause this is just cra if you don't know anything about the fire festival and the craziness that happened and the guy, the scammer that uh, to, did this with the many other people that he uh, scammed with and scammed, uh, it's just an interesting documentary. And as I said, there is going to be another one coming out on Netflix soon. So check this one out on Hulu if you have the ability. If not, wait for Netflix and see what that one is about. Either way, have yourself a great day. And don't get scammed. But make sure you have a good day. And also don't get scammed.